Wish I had a better camera, guys, but this is all I have, so... I was reading Leviticus, and I found some weird words, and I went online, and sure enough, they have Google Satan made up definitions for them, because they're just putting random words in our King James Bible, and then making up definitions so people can go, Hey, look, Google said this word means this. I'm like, uh, yeah, hello, they're making up words. Don't you get it? <laughs> like, the word innocency and astonied are now in our Bibles, and Google says that they're actually words. Sorry, but those words were not in my Bible ever, so... And they didn't exist until recently. Anyway, so yeah, here we go. Leviticus chapter 14. First of all, I kept seeing the word woolen. It's misspelled. Check that out. W-O-O-L-L-E-N. That's verse 47, 48. And then it says, it kept saying warp and woof. I don't remember ever seeing that before. And I don't think that means anything woof that's like a bark that a dog makes a barking sound but of course if you go to the internet and google it of course google satan's gonna tell you it means something but wake up guys they're making up definitions so Woof and warp is all over the place, and woolen is misspelled all over the place. And another word that's misspelled is carcass. Let me show you this. This was in chapter 11 of Leviticus. Every time the word, they wrote the word carcass, it was misspelled. Do you see that? Sorry, hold on. Can we get it? Carcass. Right there, verse 24. So it's chapter 11, verse 24. Carcass. D-A-R-C-A-S-E. And it's always being spelled the wrong way and I actually went on the internet and typed in that word like the misspelled version and it corrected it for me it's supposed to be say c-a-r-c-a-s-s -S. so there you go guys start reading your bibles and memorizing as much as you can because I don't think this is going to be stopping anytime soon